Welcome back nature enthusiasts. Today I want to share something special with you. A video I made about a recent trip to Zanzibar. Zanzibar is a storied island that was once part of a vast trading empire for cloves and other spices, for gold, ivory, and more infamously, it was the center of the slave trade in East Africa, which though finally abolished in 1873, was still in practice as late as 1909. Today, Zanzibar is a semi-autonomous region of Tanzania, famed for its white sandy beaches and laid-back vibe that's especially popular with tourists. While I was there, an idea struck. Why not journey a bit off the beaten track to visit the island's protected rainforests for a chance to encounter a rare and endangered species of red monkey found only in the world on this island. With that in mind, my friend Ryan and I set out from our comfortable beachfront hotel to spend an afternoon on an exciting adventure deep within the heart of Tanzania's breathtaking Jazani Chwaka Bay National Park, a UNESCO Biosphere Reserve. Jazani Chwaka is the only national park on the island of Zanzibar. It's known for its protected rainforest and mangrove habitat and is home to one of the rarest and most captivating creatures on the planet, the endangered Zanzibar red colobus monkey. Would we be lucky enough today to catch a glimpse of them? As we drove to the park, we were excited to find out. After meeting our official guide at the park's visitor center, he took us for a walk along the wooden boardwalk built through the coastal mangrove forest. Mangroves are unique in their ability to survive in salt water and their complex root system not only allows them to survive in this salt marsh, but also serves as a vital nursery for countless marine species. The mangroves act as a protective barrier against coastal erosion and are crucial in maintaining the delicate balance of the ecosystem. After the visit to the mangroves, we followed our guide down the path into the rainforest and found ourselves immersed in a world of vibrant biodiversity. The dense green foliage of rainforests resonating with the unique bird calls of the jungle surrounds us, our every step taking us deeper into an exotic world. Our guide leads the way and tells us that once we locate the monkeys in the rainforest, we'll need to approach them cautiously. While they're incredibly curious and used to visitors, this is their territory and we need to be sure to give them some space. We're also told to avoid eye contact with the monkeys since that could be seen by them as a sign of aggression. Our goal is to observe them in their natural habitat without disturbing their daily routine of eating fruit, sleeping, playing, grooming each other, and of course, leaping around the jungle canopy of the Zanzibar rainforest. Adapting to the ways of the jungle, we continue on behind our guide. And there they are, just above us in the treetops. The red monkeys grace us with their presence. The crimson fur is stunning and serves as an unmistakable mark of their uniqueness. Look at them move with such grace and agility. It's a mesmerizing sight to behold. These monkeys are true acrobats of the forest, and they leaped right past us many times while we were with them, jumping from tree to tree in search of fruit. Living in tight-knit social groups, these monkeys have a strong sense of family. They spend their days grooming each other, forging bonds that create a close-knit community. As we stay still and observe from a distance, it seems one of the monkeys has grown curious about our presence. This is a rare and special moment, and one we were hoping for when we came here. We were so happy to make this moment of connection with the monkeys and to imagine that our respect for their habitat and peaceful approach had earned their trust and their willingness to allow for such a close encounter. It's a truly unforgettable experience and the importance of preserving this natural habitat becomes even more apparent in moments like these. Our guide explains that the creatures who live here have paid a heavy price for humans' lack of stewardship of our planet with a number of factors contributing to the monkeys' endangered status. First, an increase in deforestation of the rainforest has resulted in a significant reduction in habitat. Second, monkeys are hunted for meat by impoverished locals or sold in pet markets. We're told that the modest, roughly $7 price of admission to the park is split with the local villagers so that they see a direct economic benefit from the continued conservation of the rainforest and the ecotourism it brings to their corner of the island. In spite of conservation efforts, this rare and unique species of red monkeys continues to decline in numbers, and we're lucky that this relatively small section of Zanzibar rainforest was set aside for them years ago so that we are able to enjoy this experience with them today. Our adventure in Jizani National Park was nothing short of awe-inspiring. We returned to the comfort of the hotel, more knowledgeable about daily life in Zanzibar, and more committed than ever 
to help spread awareness about the importance of preserving unique and precious places like this for future generations to enjoy. If you're interested to learn more about how to support the Red Monkeys of Zanzibar and the Jozani Forest, visit the official park website. If you enjoyed taking this journey as much as I did, please like this video and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching and see you again soon.